It looks as though LinkedIn have introduced a new integration with Calendly, which I detected today. So let's go and have a little look at what that looks like. This feature appears as part of your introductory card. So if we click on the pencil, it opens up the in edit intro, which is the introductory card. And if we scroll down to the bottom, it says where you have your edit custom button. Everybody can do this. This is not restricted to premium. The difference between premium and non-premium is if you have got a premium custom button, this option shows up. If you have not, it is a link and then it says none. So with the premium custom button option, you can now create an event here. So if we click on visit my store, it's gone. If you click on book an appointment, this is where it integrates directly with your Calendly. So I have an inquiry form through 17 Hats, which is a software that I use. Um, and you can check that out in a link to that in the description below. It's, I think it's phenomenal. But if we don't have something like 17 Hats, click on Create Event, and it takes you to schedule directly with your Calendly account. So you gotta sign up for a Calendly account here. Sign up with Google. And in order to use something like Calendly, which is an appointment booking system, you need to be able to access your calendar. Through the steps, what kind of work do you do? Say consulting. And you connect to your calendar, connect to your video conferencing, create your meetings. And now let's see, is it connected through to my LinkedIn? Okay, now you want to make sure that so it's it's set in the way that you want it to be set. If someone's going to book 30 minutes with me, so it's say I'm going to collect payment. You need to connect that to your Stripe or your PayPal. I'm going to connect it to Stripe. Connect with Stripe. Okay, so I'm connected to my Stripe account. Now, and let's just check so that's the basic set your meeting location. I'll check on integrations and apps. We are looking for LinkedIn. Access and share your Calendly for LinkedIn information. I did not know that this was available. Now I need to download a Calendly browser extension. So Calendly extension, add to Chrome. It can read and change all your data on all websites. Okay, it says, welcome to Calendly from Chrome. I need to now log in to my account on this Chrome. And it says, let's start scheduling. So let's close that down and let's go back to LinkedIn. Okay, so now we need to go to Calendly meeting scheduler and in here, says the setting button from the drop down menu settings and LinkedIn messaging is turned on. So now we're going to go to LinkedIn and in messaging if I want to so here is Beth can I insert a link into my messages not quite working yet is it okay so I think what we're doing here at the minute, it's not automatically doing it. So what I do is I pop that in there and then that would save it. Add a custom button. Yep, it's still saving. Okay, so that is how you're going to be able to integrate Calendly with your LinkedIn account. The messaging is not quite working for me yet, but you can see what's going to happen. It's going to allow me to insert those links into directly into LinkedIn Messenger. So very interesting collaboration or integration with LinkedIn and Calendly, which kind of explains why I appeared in the product feature article for Calendly recently. Got any questions, ask them below.